What's the leading cause of cancer death in the United States? Lung cancer. It claims more lives than breast, colon, prostate, and pancreatic cancer combined. On average, more than 450 people will die every day from lung cancer in the United States. In a year, that's just about enough people to fill every seat in Soldier Field three times. That includes the 50 yard liners and those way up in the nosebleed section. Here's the thing. Even though lung cancer is more easily treatable when it's diagnosed in its early stages, only about 20% of cancer cases are diagnosed at that time. That's no more than one out of every five cases. It doesn't have to be that way. Recent advances in technology mean that lung cancer can be reliably detected, most importantly, well before symptoms are present. How is this possible? The National Lung Cancer Screening Trial, sponsored by the National Cancer Institute, found that a process that included regular, low-dose helical CT scans can significantly reduce death due to lung cancer in heavy smokers when compared to standard chest x-rays. That's a third the dose of a regular CAT scan, and that's less than the amount of radiation you would get on a flight from New York to LA. If you're a middle-aged man or a woman and are a current or former heavy smoker, you're at high risk for lung cancer and you could benefit from the CT screening we've talked about. Ask your doctor and find out if it's right for you.